Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Build a City. This is episode 17 and today we are going to be working on a new building. So off camera I've been doing a lot of work um, since yesterday just so I could uh, flesh uh, some things out. So we've got a new section of road over here. This is the dual carriageway that's going to be leading to the Tesco as you can see there. Uh, I built these weird shapes because I thought they were cool and they are and I'm probably going to put like billboards or something on them. Uh, we got this, I guess you could call it a slip road here uh, that just sort of joins on. Um, but it's just a one way road really that joins on to another road. Um, and it's going to have like buildings and stuff either side of it. But anyway, what we're going to be working on today is building over here and we're going to be using more bricks. Yay! Um, so. Let's get started with this, shall we? So this is going to be a mechanics. Um, well, it's it's going to be uh, a good friend of mine, Mark's mechanics. Um, he's not on this world, but you know, I thought I'd uh, build something for him anyway. I'm going to do the same for some other people at some point. If you have a building that you want named after you, um, then let me know in the comments. Uh, well, let me know what you want as that building, and um, obviously I, I can look at your name, and then I will come up with a name for the building, and I will build that building at some point. Um, probably, depending on whether I've, I've already got one or whether. Oh wait, I don't want to be doing that. Or whether there's enough space for it in in the world at the time, or you know, because. Um, yeah, if you ask me to build a stadium, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that. It, like nothing too big. Um, I, I'm not obviously gonna name a stadium after one person. That's gonna be huge. Um, if you want, maybe like a corner shop or something, then uh, let me know. But yeah, this this part of the map's coming along, coming along really well. Um, oh, we've got another road over here as well. So this is going to be uh, some Tudor style houses going along here. So that's going to look cool when it's done. Uh, more work, more work on the train stations to be done, done as well. I've uh, sorted out that wall. Um, I think that's it. Oh, oh yeah, I put the lights in here as well. So when I uh, set it to night now, it looks really cool. It's done, in my opinion, perfectly. Um, so yeah, happy with that. Anyway, ooh, got a lag spike then. That's not good. I'm going to back this world up uh, after uh, the video. Right, so let's build the terracotta up like this. I'm going to have these massive doors here. They're going to be leading you in to this uh, warehouse. Is um, You know, you want a, a big old door so you can get vans and stuff in there as well rather than just cars. So that's looking good. I'm liking that. Uh, are they the same size? They look a bit different. They are the same size. Okay. Uh, this car park's uh, looking really good as well. It, it just slots in quite nicely to the side there. Uh, I also extended that wall, so that comes all the way along now. And um, yeah, start again there. So that's going to keep going along. Anyway, let's get on with the actual build, shall we? So. Um, Let's build this up a little bit, make sure this is all done properly. Uh, we're going to have like a main entrance as well, um, which will probably either be around the side or it will be in the front here and it will be like a little glass door or something like that. But uh, there will be a main entrance. So, um, yeah. Alright, so let's build this brick wall over. Also, hello Mark if you're watching this. Um, you know, obviously, like I've said, this building's uh, dedicated to yourself, so enjoy that. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, this this one's going to be a cool one. I definitely think so. Uh, right. So I think what I'll do actually is uh, the entrance will be this corner here, and I'll uh, put a door in, and that should look pretty cool. Uh, also, if you want to catch up on what I've been doing off camera, uh, quite a bit of the time, I stream what I've been doing uh, on over on Twitch. So if you want to catch up on what's been going on, then make sure to head over there, check that out, and um, yeah, you can see what's going on off camera. 
even though it's sort of on camera because I'm doing it on Twitch, but you know what I mean. Alright, uh, right. Sort that out, put in the lines. There we go. Looking good. So, um, yeah. This will be the entrance. So let's find... Okay, so it's a two-block centre. Which is fine. I can work with that. Uh, let's grab glass. And maybe glass panes up there. Yeah, I think that's nice. That's nice enough. Um, what doors have we got that we could put in? So I've got oak door, iron door, spruce door, birch door, jungle door. Or should I just not put in a door and just have it glass? I'll tell you what, something I could do is um, do this so it looks like there's an open door there. Yeah, I think I'll go with that actually, that's quite cool. Right, so. Let's get this done properly. Uh, so let's build out this wall. Make that a little bit a little bit bigger. And I'm gonna put some uh, very some white concrete on the inside here. Build that a bit further forward. Or should we do snow? We'll do snow because it's a bit more of a wool texture rather than it being completely smooth. It's got some little it, it's got texture to it, that's what it's got. Right. Uh, so I, I can shave off a couple of blocks there because it's not going to actually need to be that tall. Uh, the ceiling, I mean. I'm going to put some snow on there as well. There we go. So, looking good. And, okay. So that would be where like a little uh, front desk is and then there'll be a door that leads you into here. Which would be quite cool. So let's work on some signs above. We will do like one block and then have a, a sign above it. I think that would work quite well. Uh, we'll go for maybe some light blue, a bit of white, and a bit of dark blue as well for the, for the sign. So a bit like this, and what I'll do is I'll just build that across like that and then put random like blocks of the of the dark blue in there as well so it looks like sort of lettering I th yeah I think that's quite cool I like that uh, so let's build this brick across all the way over to here do the same over here Cool. Uh, also, I'm not sure what I should do here, whether I should put like a, a little uh, fence or whether I should just leave that open. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Um, right. Let's go over here. So that does go over the side of the door, which is fine. Light blue, and then it's one of them, one of them, and one of them, if I remember correctly. Oh, slightly wrong. Oh well, that's fine. It can be different. Alright, so, um, yeah, that's cool. Now I'm gonna have, like, some windows in here as well. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So do something a bit like that, maybe? Yeah. And then just glass. In fact, what I'm going to do is make them a bit longer, uh, just so it's not too similar to the train station windows over there. Uh, there we go. Yeah, that's looking good. I like that. Uh, maybe some terracotta underneath to sort of frame the window. Yeah, that's nice. And we'll get some brick stairs, and then we'll do like a a random uh, brick texture like this, just to give it a bit of uh, a bit of detail. So 
that should look quite nice. Uh, once that's all done, uh, we'll have a look now. Just gonna put one more in there. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. And I'll do the same over here. So bit of the bit of the old brick stairs, uh, just randomly mixed in. That gives it quite a nice nice texture. There we go. And then what about maybe some granite? Let's mix some of that in every now and again. It's so maybe like some worn out or crumbled bricks. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. Nice. Right, we'll do the same over here then. And then we'll go and do it above the door as well. And then, that will be pretty cool looking. Let's see. Yeah, I like that. Uh, so let's do a little bit above the door. Uh, maybe some there. Put a bit more there. One up there. One above the window on each side. And more above the door. We'll do two next to each other like that. And then we'll do the same over here and then we'll put in the stairs quickly. We can, uh, you know, step back and appreciate it and see it, see if it looks any good. Okay, so, yes, that looks really nice. Alright, I like that. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, so let's get out the old swiftness potion. And finish putting this together. Building it all in. Making sure it's nice and structurally sound. No, no floating signs. <laughs> Alright, there we go. And then I'm going to have the terracotta on the edge. Okay, so let's do this last little bit of detailing up here, uh, just to make sure it's all done. Uh, so that's cool, I only need the one there. And we'll do one there and one there. Okay, perfect. That's looking really nice, I like that. So, um... Hmm, what else can I do? Let me think. I'm not too sure, actually. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess I should probably start working on the side as well. Or I could come up with a quick design for the roof. Yeah, I'll do that. Let's uh, try and figure that out. We're going yet another layer, but this isn't going to have anything on it. That's just going to be a straight layer of bricks. And then we can come up with an idea for what we want to do for the roof. So I think what I'm going to do um, is something a bit like this. So we're going to have alternating blocks like that. So it looks co like corrugated iron. And I think that would be quite cool. So let's bring that across and see how that looks. Because obviously you can't do pillar quartz on the um, ceiling. Because uh, that would look a bit odd. Because it's all like chunky blocks. So um, yeah, it's not going to look great if I do it like that. Right, so I would just build it up like this. And keep going. Maybe to about there. And then uh, do the same with the slab. So this is the only problem is it's going to take forever to do this, but that's fine, I'll do it. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I think this should look quite cool. And uh, give the build quite a nice roof bit different to uh, some of the stuff around it which would be nice just to break it off a bit because I know obviously it's more more brick uh, I, I know a lot of the stuff around here is brick but that is the design I'm going for 
um, it's all supposed to be the same sort of colours. Um, but over here somewhere I'm going to do a more modern building and that'll probably be like a car dealership or something. Uh, I'm not sure, but like, yeah, it'll probably be something like that, something similar. So let's keep building this. And make sure we get it right, don't want to mess this up. Because, um, I love the new uh, intro on the series though, um, I'm happy with how that's turned out, because uh, I was hoping I'd get a good one, and that one's not so uh, it's nice. goes before the car dealership most likely um, but you know things could change but yeah the Tesco will most likely be very very soon um, the car park's gonna take ages to build because that's gonna be big uh, but the Tesco's gonna take forever because I want to do interior to that you know you got to do the the inside of it otherwise uh, it's just sort of a bit of a empty show, especially when you've got the big glass doors and stuff. It tends to help when you've done uh, an interior. Alright. Here we go. Nearly done this row. Okay, yeah, that's definitely looking good. So I'll probably do the rest of that off camera. Uh, let's go work on something else for a bit. Just so I don't get bored. <laughs> I don't want to be working on the same thing for ages and then get bored and you know. So let's go work on this pathway, I guess. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure if I am going to be able to fit a car dealership in here. I might just do like parking or something. Um, let's do just like this, like. In bits of three and four, four where it goes into a new uh, layer, then three in other places gives it that nice uh, gradual sort of fade to it, I guess. So these will all be fours. And so let's keep building them up. Oh, okay, this bit's a bit of a weird bit. So that's three. That bit would be four, then four, then four, then three, then four. And that'd be a four as well. And then... Okay, there is the grass patch, isn't there? Ah, uh, see, the problem's going to be when I get to that bit of the road. Uh, but to be fair, this does need to cross, so I might just have this path end off here, and then it can, you know, join onto this bit over here. We can see how that looks. It should look pretty cool. I'd imagine so, anyway. See, so yeah, I like that, so it sort of cuts it in half, breaks it up a little bit. 
Kind of looks like, uh, I think when we build the other one over there, it kind of looks like, uh, I don't know if any of you have played Pool 2, but there's the light bridges. Uh, it kind of looks like it's going through one portal and it's going, like, out the other side. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, that that's exactly what it looks like. <laughs> right, so I think, um, should we end the video off here? I thought we'll, we'll put that grass in and do a bit of detail in there and then yeah, I will. I uh, don't want this to be going on for too long. So, uh, yeah. Maybe like in the new uh, thumbnails as well, I'm going to try and put the episode number in every time if I can remember. Uh, I most likely will remember. And um, the intro, obviously, like I've said, is uh, doing well. We've got a bit more music in here now rather than just that one track on repeat. Um, you've got a bit more music now, so uh, that's cool. One of them is by me. Can you guess which one? <laughs> it's the really short one. <laughs> Even though you guys don't know which one the shortest one is, unless you probably count it, but from the editor I can see which one's the shortest one, and it's it's the shortest one. <laughs> right, okay, uh, so I think uh, let's put in this row of grass so we can put the trees in as well. And then I'll end off here. Uh, there we go. So let's go and put some trees in as well. Don't know why I flew over here. I don't need to fly over here, I just need to get the materials out of my inventory. I was probably going to pick block it just naturally and then realised I don't need to because I need a sapling. Right, if you didn't know this is how you get a big tree, pretty much guaranteed you'll get a big tree if you put a bit of glass just above it and next to it. Uh, so if I go to this one and do that, then big tree. See, oh that's a nice one, I like how that branch sort of just hangs down. That's really, ni really nice. Uh, in fact, we'll do... Oh no, because they're, they're clumped together, so we'll do another one over here. Um, oh no, we'll do another one... Oh yeah, no, 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 we'll, we'll do one over here. I hope you don't get one of those crap ones. Nope, we got another good one. Damn, these trees are going well. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, I like that. Because it's not, like, the same every time, so it just breaks it up a little bit and looks uh, looks quite nice. So, uh, yeah. Alright, I'm happy with that. Uh, we'll put some trees here, maybe, as well. So I believe um, the uh, daylight sensor can sense through leaves because it's a transparent block. Um, unless there's a log blocking it, which there isn't. I don't think uh, there should be a problem. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Perfect. First try. I like that. That's quite nice. Yeah, just sort of uh, adds a little bit of a background to it. Right. So, yeah, that's going to be where I end the video, because uh, we've done quite a bit. Um, especially over on this building here, which is obviously the main focus, um, which is nice. So we start to work on that. And uh, that will probably be, probably the outside will probably be, like, at least half finished um, next time. Uh, I do a video which will probably be tomorrow, depending on what I decide to do. And, um, yeah, so, uh, yeah, that'll be it for this video. Hope you all enjoy, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!